What is up, you guys? It's your favorite tarot reader, and I am back with the netheries. Okay, honey, periods. Period. I am taking personal readings. You guys could cash at me at Money Sign Caprice Cooks. You can also email me or Apple Pay me at capricecooks at iCloud.com. I work on energy. Energy is fluid. So this could be about you. This could be about the person that you're thinking about or anybody's thinking about you. Also, time is an illusion. So this could be about the past, the present, or the future, but somehow it's affecting you right now, okay? All right, y'all. So this is a little outside reading today. I tried to film a Scorpio reading today. It didn't really work out. It didn't, like, it didn't really work out. But we're going to go ahead and try to film this Libra video. Okay. okay. All right. So it is 7:46. I have 73 battery percent. So feel free to look up any angel numbers mentioned in this video. All right, y'all. So let's go ahead and get started. Spirit guides, it's in a master. So family, twin flame family, please be here with me at the time, helping me receive a message to deliver to my Libras. Come on, go sit down on the cover. Go sit down and play. I feel like go sit down and play. Go sit down and play. Thank you. You can take your shoes off if you want to and sit on the cover. But yeah, okay, so take your shoes off. Like, I feel like this is kind of like telling somebody, like, I want you to be able to relax with me. Calm yourself down. Understand that you a triangle. You're strong. You're solid. Your foundation, solid. We meet at all three corners. Like, it feels kind of like being really, really connected with somebody and, and kind of not really communicating that to them. Like, maybe not communicating to somebody how much you love them, how much you respect them, how much you love them, how cute you think they are. You know, it feels kind of like not wanting to fully express yourself, not wanting to fully give yourself. Um, but, yeah. Yeah, not really being able to fully give yourself and also seeing all these B's on the on the card. It feels like doing the impossible. Doing the impossible. Um, who is that a baby song? I don't know. But it feels like doing the impossible, like honeycombs, like combing through the honey, combing through combing through all the good things of your life, like going through with the fine tooth comb. So going over your life and looking at you know, things that maybe you didn't really like, but then also seeing the, the, the perception of, well, how did this change my life? How did this make my life better? How did I excel because of this failure? You know, so it feels kind of like communicating to yourself how worthy you are. This, to me, speaks, speaks volumes of affirmations. Maybe you're speaking loudly to yourself. Maybe you're wanting to be more heard. Maybe you're allowing your voice to finally be heard. You know, it, it, it sounds really, really loud, though, because I've been trying to film this video, and I feel like my daughter is talking over there. There's stuff going on outside. There's wind. Like, and I feel like I can't really hear myself. I feel like I can't really pay attention. So uh, maybe you're having a hard time focusing or focusing on one thing or maybe staying focused on one thing. I feel like you're really, really smart. You have really, really good ideas. And you're really, really aware of the fact that you have really, really good ideas. But it feels like you don't really know how to bring them into fruition. Libra. Um, it feels like you need a little bit of a punch, a little bit of a push, a little bit of a oomph to kind of like get you to where you want to be. Also, um, because I just tried to do that, that Scorpio reading and then the Scorpio card, I just saw it. It feels like a lot of transformation formative energy a lot of coming out of stuff and going into new chapters a lot of breaking away from things starting new things so it feels kind of like communicating that you need help communicating that you're still learning if you got a new job and you're training don't be scared to tell them like hey don't let me do everything by myself help me you know if that's what you need communicate help me i need help on the rent help me i need help with this help me i need you to watch the baby help me you know like it feels kind of like making your voice be heard when it comes to asking for the things that make you feel better and asking for the things that you need okay so we also have love the cancer card empowerment and gemini so we keep getting gemini um gemini i have my gemini is in mercury and both of these cards came out so i definitely feel like there's heavy communication issues what are you doing what are you doing? I can't open the door. Why you want to go open the door? Because it's working. Because what? Ah! 
I really hope she did not open this door. I don't think it's not a good day for me to come.